Hello and welcome to the hardest Bible quiz of all time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Make sure to watch the complete video, there's a big surprise at the end. Leave a comment below how much answers you got right. Let's go. Question 1. Who led the Israelites into the Promised Land? A. Moses. B. Aaron. C. Joshua. D. Caleb. Answer C. Joshua. Joshua 1 verse 2, Moses my servant is dead. Now therefore arise, go over this Jordan, thou, and all this people, unto the land which I do give to them, even to the children of Israel. Question 2. What was the first miracle Jesus performed? A. Healing a blind man. B. Turning water into wine. C. Walking on water. D. Feeding the 5,000. Answer B. Turning water into wine. John 2 verse 9, When the master of the feast had tasted the water that was made wine, and knew not whence it was, but the servants which drew the water knew, the governor of the feast called the bridegroom. Question 3. Which book comes directly after the Gospels in the New Testament? A. Acts. B. Romans. C. Genesis. D. Revelation. Answer A, Acts. Acts 1 verse 1, The former treatise have I made, O Theophilus, of all that Jesus began both to do and teach. Question 4. Who was the oldest person in the Bible? A, Noah. B, Adam. C, Methuselah. D, Abraham. Answer C. Methuselah. Genesis 5 verse 27, And all the days of Methuselah were nine hundred sixty and nine years, and he died. Question 5. What was the sign of the covenant between God and Noah? A. A star. B. A rainbow. C. A dove. D. A flood. Answer B, a rainbow. Genesis 9 verse 13, I do set my bow in the cloud, and it shall be for a token of a covenant between me and the earth. Question 6. Who interpreted the dreams of the Pharaoh in Egypt? A, Daniel. B, Joseph. C, Moses. D, David. Answer B, Joseph. Genesis 41 verse 12, And there was there with us a young man, an Hebrew, servant to the captain of the guard, and we told him, and he interpreted to us our dreams, to each man according to his dream he did interpret. Question 7. Which book is known as the Weeping Prophet? A, Isaiah. B, Jeremiah. C, Ezekiel. D. Daniel. Answer B. Jeremiah. 
Jeremiah 9 verse 1 Oh that my head were waters, and mine eyes a fountain of tears, that I might weep day and night for the slain of the daughter of my people. Question 8. Who was not a son of Jacob? A. Judah. B. Levi. C. Simon. D. Luke. Answer D. Luke. Genesis 35 verse 23, the sons of Leah, Reuben, Jacob's firstborn, and Simeon, and Levi, and Judah, and Issachar, and Zebulun. Question 9. In which book of the Bible is the fruit of the Spirit mentioned? A. Romans. B. Galatians. C. Ephesians. D. Philippians. Answer B, Galatians. Galatians 5 verses 22 to 23, but the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance, against such there is no law. Question 10. Who replaced Judas as the twelfth apostle? A. Matthias. B. Barnabas. C. Silas. D. Timothy. Answer A. Matthias. Acts 1 verse 26, And they gave forth their lots, and the lot fell upon Matthias, and he was numbered with the eleven apostles. Don't forget the surprise at the end. Question 11. Which psalm is known as the Th Shepherd Psalm? A. Psalm 23. B. Psalm 100. C. Psalm 150. D. Psalm 119. Answer A, Psalm 23. Psalm 23 verse 1, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Question 12. Who was the first martyr in the New Testament? A, Paul. B, Peter. C, John. D, Stephen. Answer D, Stephen. Act 7 verse 59, And they stoned Stephen, calling upon God, and saying, Lord Jesus, receive my spirit. Question 13. Which prophet was told to marry a prostitute? A, Hosea. B, Jeremiah. C, Ezekiel. D, Amos. Answer A, Hosea. Hosea 1 verse 2, The beginning of the word of the Lord by Hosea. And the Lord said to Hosea, Go, take unto thee a wife of whoredoms and children of whoredoms, for the land hath committed great whoredom, departing from the Lord. Question 14. In the book of Daniel, who interpreted King Nebuchadnezzar's dream? A. Shadrach. B. Meshach. C. Abednego. D. Daniel. Answer D. Daniel. Daniel 2 verse 26, The king answered and said to Daniel, whose name was Belteshazzar, 
Art thou able to make known unto me the dream which I have seen, and the interpretation thereof? Question 15. What was Paul's profession? A. Carpenter. B. Fisherman. C. Tent maker. D. Tax collector. Answer C, tent maker. Acts 18 verse 3, And because he was of the same craft, he abode with them, and wrought, for by their occupation they were tent makers. Thanks for watching. Time to put your results in the comments. And here's the surprise. Share this video on Facebook with the hashtag BibleQuiz to win a free shirt from our merchandise shop. Good luck.